Oh, there it goes. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Bienvenidos a todos. Welcome. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Angela Rodriguez, the curriculum principal of Highland High School. On behalf of the entire Highland cluster and community, it is my pleasure to welcome you to the 2024 Highland High School commencement ceremony. Please rise for the processional as performed by the Highland High School Band under the direction of Ms. Josephine Gonzalez. After the processional, please remain standing.
The presentation of our colors will be presented by the Highland High School Junior Naval ROTC led by Captain William Lane. The national anthem will be performed by Highland High School's choir under the direction of Ms. Cyan Garcia. Gentlemen, please remove your caps and remain standing until the colors have left the floor. Gentlemen, please replace your caps. You may be seated. <clears throat> At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce Rosaline Garcia, student body historian. Good afternoon and welcome to the 74th commencement ceremony on our school's treasured history. Highlands doors have been open for nearly 75 years and we are the oldest standing high school in Albuquerque. It is with great pride that we stand before you. I am Rosalind Garcia, your student body historian, and it is my privilege to introduce to you our honored guest in attendance today. Please rise as I call your name. Mr. Scott Elder, our APS superintendent, Mark Garcia, Associate Superintendent of Goal 3. <laughs> Ms. Heather Benavides, APS Board Member. <laughs> we also have honored students from the Class of 2024 on stage. Please rise when I call your name. Alize Cruz, Senior Class President. <laughs> Grisel Huizar, Senior Class Vice President and your 2024 <laughs> Selfless Senior. Valeria Peinado Avalos, Senior Class Secretary. <laughs> Daniel Vasquez, Senior Class Treasurer. <laughs> Vanessa Sarabique, Senior Class Historian. <laughs> Allison Ruiz, Student Body Treasurer. 
Miriam Marias, Student Body Secretary. Asael Montes, Student Body President. Yaneli Ortega, Class of 2024, Salud Victorian. Athena Amadeus, Class of 2024, Valid Victorian. And now I'd like to introduce you two leaders that have been immensely involved in Highlands activities throughout their four years. They have dedicated themselves to making Highland the best it can be. And I am pleased to introduce Senior Class Treasurer Daniel Vasquez and Senior Class Historian Vanessa Sarabique. <laughs> Daniel Valesa, please come up and introduce the administration of Highland High School. First. I would like to recognize the experienced and diverse faculty and staff we have at Highland High School. They have supported us and encouraged our success in both academics and extracurricular activities. We would like to thank them for their knowledge and contributions they have provided us. Because this day means as much to them as it does to our class, please stand to be recognized. The members of the class of 2024 would also like to thank our families who have been extremely supportive and generous in helping us stand here today. Without the guidance we received from our loved ones, we would not have achieved this goal of graduation. Family members of the graduates, please stand to be recognized. Our last thank you goes to our administration and leadership team who has helped us in so many ways these past few years. Please rise as I call your name. Ms. Angela Rodriguez, Curriculum Principal. Ms. Dina Barella, Special Education Principal. Mr. Justin Woody, Dean of Students. Ms. Heather Ailes, Dean of Student Success. Mr. John Barnhill, Athletics Director and Mr. Justin Landis, Activities Director. And last but not least, I would like to introduce to you Mr. Marco Harris, our Highland High School Principal. Mr. Harris, will you please come up and say a few words? So, good afternoon. So first I'd like to uh, recognize some of our uh, amazing VIPs to the east side of the stage, which is your right. Um, first, these are individuals who have played a part in maybe some, maybe all of your lives at some point in your existence within APS. And so to your left, my left, excuse me, I'd like to all send a shout out to Bethany Spratley, one of our language arts teachers at Highland High School. Miss Laura Novato, family liaison, along with our community school coordinator, Charlton Simmons. We uh, exited an, an administrator early in our year, but she was lucky enough to get the principalship at Mission Elementary School, Miss Jennifer Tooley. We also exited another staff member to one of our local high schools, uh, Sandia High School, that would be the curriculum assistant, Matt Singleton. I'll try to not mess up this guy's name. I think it's he 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 Jesus Villarreal, as well as John and Carla from Upward Bound. Could you please stand and be recognized? Would the principal from Weary Elementary School, Miss Cecily Ryan, stand to be recognized? And, and, and the principal at one of my old stomping grounds, Wilson Middle School, Mr. Matthew Burroughs. We have the Executive Director of Student Family and Community Service Center, uh, T.C. Reiser. It is in the house, I believe. Nope. Let's send her some love out <laughs> in the virtual world. And um, I'd also love to recognize the probably major reason why all of you are sitting here today. Um, with all your credits and requirements in place, all those grades in, in, in the right space, 
Uh, but I'd really love to send a huge shout out to our phenomenal counseling team from Highland High School. We have, we have Brian, please stand. You guys got to stand. Brian, Margaret, Taisha, uh, Miss Delgadillo, Shauna, Miss Frankel over there. But that's our amazing uh, counseling team. So good afternoon again, and welcome to the 74th commencement ceremony. Can't believe next year Highland High School will be 75 years into existence. Today we are celebrating the journey of class of 2024. Before we get started, I want to send a shout out to my, um, a person very close to me, John Treadwell Nichols, my father-in-law, who passed away earlier this year. Um, I miss you, Big J, just FYI. Now I don't clap, we'll move on. Um, I would also like to share some very special thanks, uh, thank yous to our community partners who have embraced Highland's commitment to the facilitation of the community school key practices to increase and impact positive student outcomes. First, from Arches, Ashley Proctor, would you please stand? A Highland alum, owner of Mr. B's Auto Body, Scott Benavides. Uh, our future broadcast Hornet Radio sponsor, Byron Padrell. We have uh, the Boys and Girls Club. I've, I've given a little love to Miss Lauda already, but I'd like to get, send a shout out to Miss Brenda as well, who works in the hub with our young people all day. I'm losing two families who've been part of my leadership life for the last 15 years. Um, I really appreciate your trust in me uh, and the leader in leading your children to. I don't know, the next stage in their lives. Uh, but the Peña Munoz family, as well as the Mendez family, giving you a little love out there. Thank you for, I don't know, producing great kids. And last but not least, I am gonna send a shout out. We did a slightly formal one uh, last night, uh, but, or yesterday, excuse me, but I'd really like to send a shout out to Miss Sandra Dubois, who will be retiring this year from Highland High School and I've, over 20 plus years of service. And we thank you for your time, your energy, and your service, Ms. Dubois. These young people deserve you. Hornets, AKA COVID kids. You started your high, school, your high school journey as a little pulsating bubble on a computer screen. Little did, he, did we know that you would become one of the most in tune classes that I've had pleasure to lead. I use air quotes lead because the class of 2024 never needed a leader. They had 199 influencers, as each of these hornets have been vocal about the path they've been willing to take. It hasn't always felt clear, but your self-awareness has given you the tools to persevere through the tough times. You have regulated your behaviors, studying, tutoring, co and curricular uh, involvement, co and extracurricular involvement, to support focused outcomes. In turn, building a strong foundation for self-efficacy to promote a space for belonging. Hornet Nation. The class of 2024 has embodied the characteristics of excellence more than any of our previous classes. You learned how to access your education online and in person to transition to high school. You learned how to make real friends in a virtual and real world setting, as well as ensured that everyone's pronouns, feelings, and motivations were all in alignment to create Highland as your safe space to fail forward towards success. Sorry, wrong way. Uh, the speeches that you will hear from your peers, Yanelli Ortega, Athena Amadeus, and Alize Cruz, and Aziel Montes uh, today capture the essence of the class of 2024 and the selflessness, like Grizel, uh, this group of young adults ooze. I am humbled to be in the presence of your, uh, of, in your presence today and will always look back fondly on the contributions this class has provided for the future Hornets. Allison, you're up. Thank you, Mr. Harris. Now please welcome Highlands Choir who will perform a mashup of Class 2024, Show Goes On by Lupe Fiasco and Memories by Maroon 5.
one more round of applause for our choir. It is now my pleasure to introduce our first graduation speaker and your 2024 salutatorian, Yaneli Ortega. Yaneli. Yaneli has been very involved in her four years at Highland, including multiple sports and clubs. She is the daughter of Blanca Garcia and Alberto Ortega. She is the oldest of her siblings and will be heading to Occidental College in Los Angeles this fall to pursue a major in political science and government. Please join me in welcoming 2024 salutatorian Yaneli Ortega. Good afternoon, fellow graduates, esteemed faculty and family. For those who may not know me, my name is Janelle Ortega, and I'm deeply honored to stand before you as one of the representing members of our class of 2024 graduates. Today, I would like to recognize just how far our graduating class has come. From being bubbles on a screen our freshman year, to attending classes and, sorry, to attending classes and and walking the halls as if one year of our high school experience wasn't taken by us because of COVID. Our graduating class, despite this adversity and rigged games of Powder Puff that we lost, we did not stop laughter and enjoyment of our last year of high school. As we prepare to embark into this new chapter in our lives, I want to remind you that through your hard work, each and every one of you have gotten this far, and whatever path you choose to pursue after today is just as reachable. Don't be afraid to dream big and take risks. If you want to be a professional TikToker, so be it. Being dots on the screen and coming back in person is nothing compared to that. Life is too short and time goes by fast. Speaking of time, I should probably move on. I would like to thank our teachers and staff who have, who have supported us in this journey and have put up with our senioritis and last minute assignments. Lastly, there are two very important people I would like to personally thank. My biggest inspiration, my parents, who gave it all and for whom today I walk the stage. Estando en este escenario, quiero agradecerles a mis más grandes inspiraciones, a mi mamá y papá. <laughs> a mi mamá y papá. Quiero que sepan que hoy estoy aquí no simplemente por mis logros, sino por sus sacrificios y apoyo incondicional. Al igual que muchas familias hispanas, mis padres han sacrificado el no ver sus familias para brindarme un mejor futuro y por eso no hay palabras que describan el agradecimiento que les tengo. Cheers to the best graduating class, the class of 2024. Congrats, Yanelli. Now, welcome Highland, Highland High School's class of 2024 valedictorian, Athena Amendias. <laughs> Athena is the daughter of Cornelius and Rosanna. Athena has been immensely involved here at Highland and will be attending Rice University in the fall, majoring in biosciences with a concentration in integrative biology. Please join me in welcoming Athena Amendias. Good afternoon, friends, family, staff members, teachers, and most importantly, class of 2024. As we know, our class didn't have an ideal freshman year. Our first day of school didn't involve walking through Highland's doors for the first time to experience what it was like to be in high school. Due to COVID, our lives have changed. Although this is the case, I urge you to focus on the favorable events that still occurred despite this setback. Over four years, we made friends and memories. Amid numerous homework assignments, tests, and projects, 
we formed invaluable bonds with each other and created unforgettable experiences. I hope you can look back at these times through an optimistic lens and celebrate the achievements you have earned so far. Take pride in your accomplishments because they display your considerable dedication. Your continuous resilience is what advanced you to this moment. I want to recognize some of Highland's faculty that some people might tend to overlook. These individuals have contributed to campus greatly. Talio, a member of the custodial team, and Richard, Gino, James, Sham, Joe, and Nicole, who are part of the security team. We have We appreciate the hard work you put into carrying out your duties each day. Additionally, I will bring to light the welcoming attitudes of Mr. Moppert and Ms. Liana in the library. Also, shout out to our athletics director, Mr. Barnhill. I'd like to acknowledge the people who were the most influential during my time in high school. Ms. G, thank you for continuing to foster my love for music and for making band more exciting. <laughs> my counselor, Ms. Rodriguez, your love for me, sorry, your eagerness to support me and other students is incredibly admirable. Mr. Singleton, you have influenced my curiosity in science and thank you, Coach Platt, for being uplifting during math class and tennis matches. <laughs> Mom and Dad, you have loved and supported me endlessly without fail. Thank you for the sacrifices you've made to help me grow. Lastly, I'd like to emphasize how God has always been with me throughout my life, and I wouldn't have succeeded without him. For insight, I could tell you to prioritize the present or to not take life for granted, but I know you are living by these mottos already. Instead, I would like for you to think about the circumstances that inspire you. I encourage you to search for something to look forward to in every aspect of your lives. Consider the details of your life that make it unique. Make each day compelling. Discover the roles you play in the world. Find the actions and ideas that motivate you to keep going. What gives you purpose? Who will you positively impact in your lives? Thank you and congratulations, class of 2024. Thank you, Athena, and congratulations on being valedictorian. Give her a big hand. Now, we would like to introduce your 2023-2024 student body and senior class presidents, Asael Montes and Alize Cruz, who will, be giving their, who will be giving their senior farewell addresses. First up, please welcome Alize. Good afternoon, Highland staff, faculty, and friends and family, my fellow graduates. Four years and one pandemic later, we come together to celebrate the end of an unforgettable chapter of our lives. It feels like just yesterday we were all hiding behind screens, driving our teachers insane because they had no idea if we were paying attention. Newsflash, we weren't. We were either sleeping or scrolling through TikTok. Now we are minutes away from turning the tassel with the wave of emotions flowing through us. We've laughed together, shed a couple tears here and there, and now for a fact, we all fool all-nighters together because what's a Highland graduating class without all of us doing everything last minute? Most importantly, we've all grown. We entered these halls as kids and are, and are now leaving as adults who are heading on to the next chapter of their lives. Hashtag, we survived. Now, before I get too ahead of myself, we couldn't have done it alone. We had an amazing support system here at Highland who pushed us to be the best we possibly can. To all our teachers who have helped us the past four years, thank you. To our families, thank you for making the sacrifices you made in order to see us where we are today. To my advisor, Justin Landis, thank you for always being there for us and letting us evade your office. I hope your outro doesn't happen for a long time. 
Now, the water sign in me is going to make an appearance, so be patient with me. I'd like to say a few thank yous to the most important people in my life. To my family, gracias a Dios y por ustedes estoy aquí. To Abby, Nana, and Gael, my biggest heartaches and headaches, I, all my love goes out to you three. To my friends, thank you for making this ex experience unforgettable. Long live us. And finally, to the two people who have got in front row seats in my excessive eyeliner phase, my parents. My dad has always told me que con Dios todo se puede. He's given me endless lectures and tough love. Gracias por todo lo que haces por mí. And to my mom, my hero, thank you for believing in me when I couldn't. You are my rock, the strongest person I know. I know I don't... I don't know what I would do without you. I know I drive you both crazy and don't show it enough, but from the bottom of my heart, I love you both. And finally, from the class of 2024, we want to give a huge thank you to Quinsley and Snapchat AI. You guys are the real winners tonight. <laughs> yeah. My name is Alizé Cruz, and it was my honor to serve as your senior class president. I hope you all made the most of these past four years. This is the end of our chapter, but not the end of our book. The show goes on, right? Before I end my speech, I'll leave you all with this. Do what you love and what fulfills your life. Go on to do big things, but don't forget what it took, you what it took to get you there. P.S., for all time's sake, I turned in this speech the night before it was due. <laughs> Thank you and congratulations to you all. Now please help me welcome your student body president, Asael Montes. To the graduating class of 2024, what I definitely do need to say first is that we did it. We worked so hard for four years to be able to walk this stage. You should all be proud of yourselves. From what I normally have seen or been told is that the speech I give should be teaching you something, but I really can't do that when I'm still learning as well. So I will instead tell you why you should all be proud of completing another chapter in your life. We started our high school career during a pandemic. We never finished our eighth grade year, so we never got to go on that eighth grade field trip or our eighth grade ceremony. That all happened in 2020. Now, four years later, we're the COVID eighth graders that were invited to all the senior events. I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I, sometimes I was still mentally stuck a year behind because we never got that closure from leaving middle school. Even with the weird beginning, we still made it through because we helped each other out, or you pushed yourself to accomplish the goal of getting your diploma. With the stress that we got because of school, I hope all of you did make amazing memories this year because you will cherish these memories forever even if it was just a small conversation you had with someone or ditching a class with someone. But if you're an underclassman, do not ditch. I'm sorry, Principal Harris, if it starts to go down. <laughs> anyway, you should appreciate these memories because they were the last ones of your high school career. This is the last time that you will be, able, you will be in the same room with all the people that you went to school with for the past four years. Last week was the last time you could say, see you tomorrow, because after today, you might not be going to the same school. One one last thing I will say to you all is that you are the ones creating your future. Do not let other people control it because they do not know what you are going through and in general are not you. I would like to thank your, our teachers and staff for that supported us and helped us pass our classes. Most of us will not be here without your help. Me gustaría agradecer a mi mamá por apoyarme en todas las decisiones que hago, incluso las decisiones que ella no está de acuerdo. Le agradezco a mi papá por todo lo que me ha dado. I would like to give thanks to my sister, Wendy, because she is always there for me whenever I have a problem. I know that I can always count on her to be with me all the time. To my little brother, Saeed, for telling me that he is proud of me all the time, even though he might not be sure of what I did. <laughs> Thank you to my cousins, Rosaline, Grisel, and Miriam, for supporting me and being there since we were born every step of the way. And a special thanks to my cousin, Yareli, for inspiring me to become student body president Without her, I would not be standing on the stage and giving this speech. One final thank you to Landis for everything he has done for me. I appreciate it so much, and I'm sorry for making fun of your height all these years. I would add more, but I'm running out of time. Thank you. Thank you, Alizé and Aziel. Can you give them one more round of applause, please?
This graduating class has produced over 40 bilingual SEAL recipients, multiple band members that have incurred superior ratings in their MPA, multiple state champions in FCCLA, basketball, wrestling, and esports. In addition, this class has been awarded more than $6 million in Pell Grants and scholarships. Huh, what more needs to be said? Oh, I know. APS Superintendent, Scott Elder. And Associate Superintendent of Goal 3, Mark Garcia. And esteemed board member, Heather Benavides. The graduates before you have duly met and completed all requirements as set forth by the New Mexico Public Ed Department and have also met all the requirements as set forth by the Albuquerque Public Schools Board of Education and are hereby fully qualified to receive an official New Mexico high school diploma. These students are fully certified for graduation. It is my pleasure with great honor to present to the Highland High School present to you the Highland High School graduating class of 2024. On behalf of the Albuquerque Public Schools Board of Education, we accept this 2024 graduating class of Highland High School. Congratulations, Hornets. Will the first row of the class of 2024 please stand? Destiny Gonzalez. <laughs> Shailene Abadam. <laughs> Joseph Abale. <laughs> Daniel Acevedo Vargas. Jacqueline Aguilar. <laughs> Leslie Alarcón Valenzuela. Ingrid Alcalá. Hilal Aldiab. Maricela Alford. Mesa Al Khalil. Matthew Joshua Rodrigo de Jesus Alvarado Coldivar. Obed Alvarez Bautista. <laughs> Destiny Alvarez Vigil. <laughs> Alexis Amancio. <laughs> Athena Amindias. Alondra Andrade Martinez. Arleth Andrade Martinez. Dominic Apellanes.
Miriam Arias Arcineda. Nicolás Arias. Andy Arismendi. Carla Arredondo. Marissa Arroyo. Kayla Atencio. Nazaria Battle. Juan Manuel Bassan. Aideli Bassan Saleta. Armando Bitsi. Anita Bodiford. Mackenzie Brooks. Cheyenne Brown. Malachi Burgess. Ricardo Calderon Alvarez. Itzel de Los Angeles, Calix Larga Espada. Dylan Campa. Brianna Cano, Tena. Lucas Cardona. Jose Francisco Carias Montoya. Alondra Carmona Ramos. Anadalai Carrasco. Almendra Carrera Ramirez. Leighton Cohey. Alicia Dominique Coriz. Linda Darlene Coriz Salazar. Richard Crotzer. Alice Cruz Sanchez. Armando Cruz. David Cuneo. Keenan Day. Sherlyn De La Cruz. Jamar Dean. Joel Andres Delgado. Lino Delgado Conejo. Devin Dolores. Just so 
Juma Ibaquielo. Alan Edmundson. Jakari Edwards. Michael Indito. Kevin Enriquez. Maria Fernanda Enriquez. Dana Enriquez Garcia. Xavier Espinosa. Gabrielle Fingerlos. Alexis Flores Dominguez. Rain Fuentes. Amaya Garcia. Ivan Garcia. Jose Garcia. Leslie Garcia. Naomi Garcia. Patricia Garcia. Rosaline Garcia. Emmanuel Garcia Madera. Fatima Garcia Madera. Michelle Gaspar Martinez. Valeria Jerónimo Jimenez. Isael Hill Washington. Henry Gomez. Misael Gomez Guevara. Brandon Gomez Valdez. Kimberly Gonzalez. Summerstar Gonzalez. William Gonzalez. Marvin Gonzalez Romero. Jesus Gonzalez Valdez. Abraham Gracia. Elijah Gurule. Jessica Hyro. Freddie Ann Hakizimana.
Jeremiah Hatton. Elijah Hernandez. Serenity Hernandez. Santiago Herrera. Grisel Huizar. Joshua Ibarra. Davion Jackson. Corey Jones. Arnaldo Ledesma. Zion Liberty. Moises Lira. Nathan Livingston. Brooklyn Lotus. Andrea Luera. Danielle Lopez. Denise Areli Lopez Hernandez. Isaiah Lord. Gabriel Loya Luna. Adriana Lozano. Nevea Lujan. Jose Magaña. Xavier Manuelito. Janae Martin. Alexia Martinez. Areli Martinez. Brianna Martinez. Mia Martinez. Narali Martinez Garcia. Ingrid Mata Muniz. Alondra Medina. Isaiah Mendez. Jordan Mendez Cardosa. Yesenia Mendez Guardado. Karen Merino. Castle Miller. Rebecca Valdez. Shakufa Mohammadi. Asael Montes Huizar. (laughs) 
Ruben Montes. Zoe Montoya. <laughs> Axel Morales. <laughs> Fatima Muniz Canales. <laughs> Alondra Nahar. Matthew Nelson. Jimena Nevarez Cruz. Julian Nevarez Ponce. Alan Wen. Danny Nguyen. <laughs> Kwa Nguyen. Estrella Nolasco. Chantal Zabayo. <laughs> Ashley Orozco. <laughs> Brisa Orozco. <laughs> Mayra Ortega. Yaneli Ortega. Adamariz Padilla Arambula. Tanagda Pavoko. Maya Payan. <laughs> Valeria Peinado Avalos. <laughs> Marcos Peña Muñoz. <laughs> Edgar Perez. Elizabeth, Elizabeth Perez. Jordan Perez Lopez. Jacqueline Perez Para. Yasmin Ponce Robles. America Puga. Alexa Quinones Villa. Daniel Quintero Vega. <laughs> Esli Kirarte. <laughs> Jose Quiroz Montaño.
Diego Reyes. Marcus Riley. Dario Arturo Rios Robles. Mary Rivera Fernandez. Josiah Rodriguez. Karen Rodriguez. Angelica Romero. Ivan Romero. Brian Ruano Rivera. Allison Ruiz. Allison Ryan. Herman Salazar. Yoseline Stephanie Salazar Flores. Thais Sanchez. Estras Sanek Paten. Cruz Santos Rodriguez. Vanessa Saravike. Gilbert Secatero. Jason Shendo. Ella Smith. Monica Solis Nahar. Jesus Suarez. Alberto Torres Escarcega. Redia Tosha. <laughs> Valentin Uwinga Bire. <laughs> Benjamin Valencia. Frené Vargas. Edwin Daniel Vasquez. Ankara Florea Vasquez Calderon. Luis Viegas. Alan Vo. Sarah Salima.
Caleb Whittington. Ariana Williams. Emiliano Zapien. Iomana Zuni Campbell. What's up, class of 2024? How's it going today? I just, I just wanted to say we finally achieved our goal after 12, 13 years of school. Our hard work, effort, and sa sacrifices are what made us be here graduating, and we all should be proud of this significant milestone. Gracias a todos nuestros padres por su apoyo y esfuerzo por motivarnos a estar aquí presentes obteniendo un diploma y sin su apoyo no estuviéramos cumpliendo nuestra meta de, de graduarnos. We all should be proud of how far we, we have come these past four years and our effort earned us this goal. Congratulations to the class of 2024. Felicidades a la clase de 2024. <laughs> Now it is time. Class of 2024, please stand up. Okay. Will you please move your tassel from the right to the left? Congratulations, class of 2024. We send our sincerest well wishes for your success and our deep appreciation for the significant impact you have had on Highland High School. Graduates of class of 2024, please rise, please stay standing for the recess, recessional. Parents, family members, and friends, you may meet your graduates in the parking lot next to the creative park, next to the creative art parking lot west of the Coliseum. We thank you all for joining today to celebrate our graduates. 